What's up, everybody? <laughs> what a great night, right? For my team, uh, we came in there, we trained hard together, you know, me and Canelo, and we did what we do in the gym. I mean, I didn't really expect anything else than that. Um, I know I was getting a lot of slack, and people were saying that, uh, you know, maybe I was too cautious, I didn't want to take this fight, and, you know, I was scared of the power, or I wasn't ready. Uh, I think I proved that, you know, that wasn't the case this fight. I've been working with a lot of things with Eddie, uh, and I showcased that. Um, I know it was only one round, but I definitely, if it would have settled in, I promised you guys would have seen the improvements, but it didn't get the chance to do it. Um, but I just want to thank God, thank you, Jesus, for, uh, you know, getting me through this. Thank you to my team, my dad. Thank you to Lupe, my advisor. Thank you to Golden Boy, Oscar, my guy Bernard, always giving me motivation. Every time I talk to him, it's like, man, I know I'm going to get something. So, um, and I just want to thank, you know, Robert Diaz, everybody part of the whole show, you know, uh, the zone. This is just a dream come true for me. I never really thought, you know, coming from Victorville, you know, I had to train in a garage because we have no money for a uh, gym membership. You know, I started making videos on Instagram, you know, me just all flashy and, you know, c climbing up the amateur ranks, you know, I was on top of there, but like nobody ever gave me my credit even back then. You know, they looked at me and said, ah, this kid looks a certain way. Uh, he'll never become a champion. He'll never be able to do it in the pros. And I always just had that, that passion inside me and that will to prove everybody wrong. But, you know, thank you, God. And thank you, everybody, for... Uh, Coming out, thank you.